opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The French defense prepares for d5, but blocks in the light squared bishop in exchange for a strong center and counter-attacking chances. d3 is a somewhat timid move compared to the normal 2.d4, but is a playable alternative that is hoping to create a more closed position. d5 gains space in the center and attacks the e4 pawn. QE2 develops the queen and supports the e4 pawn. After all captures, this is an equal trade. Recaptures. Master games. It is the last book move. This misses a better way to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores a better way to defend a pawn that was under attack. It is an inaccuracy. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. It is good. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable queen. It is excellent. That's fine. It is good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is good. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is excellent. The opposing queen is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This misses a better way to move a queen to safety. This allows the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This kicks an opposing bishop. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. This threatens to attack a trapped bishop. It is a mistake. This strikes at the center with a pawn, fighting for space. This stops the opponent from being able to attack a trapped bishop. It is best. There was only one good move in that position. This permits the opponent to fork pieces. It is a mistake. This forks multiple pieces. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to capture a vulnerable pawn. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This leads to losing a pawn. This threatens to attack a trapped bishop. It is a blunder. This wins a pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This ignores an opportunity to recapture a piece. It is a mistake. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is a mistake. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. There was only one good move there. It is a mistake. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This ignores an opportunity to increase a bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. It is a miss. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is a great move. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is best. This stops the opponent from being able to take an outpost with a knight. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a knight. It is good. This loses a queen. It is an inaccuracy. This wins material. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This moves the pawn to safety. It is best. This loses a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. That was a free pawn. 
it is best. This is the way to win a pawn. It is excellent. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. This threatens to fork pieces. It is good. This misses a great but hard to find move. It is an inaccuracy. This evades the check from the knight. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. This is the way to win a bishop. It is excellent. This defends a bishop that was under attack and had no defenders. It is good. This captures a vulnerable bishop. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking queen. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This overlooks an opportunity to capture a bishop that was threatening to win material. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a pawn. It is excellent. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is best. That was a free pawn. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is good. A very strong play. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. This allows a forced checkmate. It is an inaccuracy. This wins material. It is good. This removes a knight that put the king in check. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This steps away from the checking queen. It is forced. Recaptures, from a previous move. It is best. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is excellent. This wins a queen. It is best. This evades the check from the queen. It is best. That leaves a queen vulnerable to being captured. This allows the opponent to capture the checking queen. It is a blunder. This loses material. This misses a chance to obtain a winning position. This ignores an opportunity to capture a vulnerable queen. It is a miss. This loses material. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. It is a miss. This allows a forced checkmate. This missed a move that would have produced a winning position. This overlooks an opportunity to capture a vulnerable queen. It is a blunder. This forces an eventual checkmate. It is good.